guys, so for this tutorial, I'm starting off on stretched hair, as well as an old Bantu knot out. It started getting old, so being that this video was highly requested, I wanted to show you guys how I created this fluffy Bantu knot out. I decided to start off with medium sized sections because I don't want to be here all day. I'm using my tangle teaser, which is a great detangling method, making sure to smooth out any knots or tangles to get a really defined look. For this style, I will only be using one product, and that one product is Mayel Organics Pomegranate and Honey Twisting Souffle. I love this stuff. It's so amazing. It smells amazing. It's super moisturizing, and it prevents frizz. So as you can tell, I'm starting off with a generous amount of product, making sure that my hair is fully hydrated and moisturized. I'm then gonna go in with my Tangle Teaser just to smooth all the product into my hair evenly. Next, I'm just gonna take my hair and split it into two sections as if I was doing a twist out. Once I'm done twisting my hair all the way down to the ends, I'm going to then create a circular knot as close to my roots and keep wrapping and twisting my hair until it looks like a Cinnabon. When you get to the ends, tuck them around. If you're having a hard time keeping them secure, grab a few bobby pins. Repeat this step on each section until you complete your entire head. And voila, my Bantu knots are all finished. Not too bad, my head is throbbing a little bit, but beauty is pain. I'm gonna sleep with these overnight just to ensure that the product is fully dry. I'm gonna apply my satin scarf, go to sleep, and I will show you guys the results in the morning. So the next morning has come and it's time for the takedown. I'm just gonna apply some oil to make it easy to unravel and prevent any frizz. All I'm doing is pulling down the knots like I'm twisting a doorknob. After that, you just want to gently separate each section and coil the ends to get a fuller look. If you like a lot of volume, then go ahead and use a pick and begin pulling at the roots until you get the desired look.
this is the final look i hope you guys enjoyed this video if so be sure to give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button thanks for watching guys i'll see you in my next video